Welcome back to That Equitas Plays. We're playing Death's Door, Part 4, Squid Soup. <laughs> Need to see if we can remember some of the uh, secrets the squid, <laughs> the squid controlled chef told us about. And continue on our journey to get the third giant soul. Uh, totally a human person and not <laughs> totally not Definitely. tearing this guy's corpse. Yep. Totally a mammal. Ah. Here's our friend, Clever Grunt. <laughs> Jeff's son make delicious soup. He has dark secret not many people know. Grunt saw straight away. Jeff's son not really professional chef. But Grunt no care. Soup is delicious. <laughs> That's great. Alright. Let's go back and see if we can deal with that boss, that old boss thing on the other side of the map. Shorter route, honestly. This is fine. Oh, that's the wrong way. Wood. The door might actually be closer. Unfortunate. Out we go. Loading screen between these. Alright. Let's go. We get to that shrine real bad. bad. Ooh, okay. I feel like I nearly got, got them that time. They were glowing bright red with cracks. Nearly had the timing just right at the beginning. And then I got whacked a bunch. Okay, let's try that again. Ah, it actually put me at the nearest door. How nice. Devious route. Go. I will defeat this enemy. I must. Got me a couple times last night, and I just gotta get it. I have to take on the challenge. I want that shrine. Get up there, that's a magic shrine. That should actually give me a magic shot, which would be in Korea. I forgot to. Jeez. So close again. <coughs> <coughs> okay. I have returned with soup. One more try. Well, <laughs> one more try if I win. Uh, 
Penny Lee's can carry you so fast, you know. I wonder if uh, the next power will be the power to flap my wings a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't that be nice? Who cares? I have wings. I have wings. Don't you know? You want that shrine? Want that extra magic? damage. Glad I gave some extra oomph. Oh yes. Oh, it's exactly where I wanted to be. It's gonna take me to the shrine. I'm gonna get more magic. Yes. Here we go. Hand it over. You should try it off as a shard. Match for Peter Crystal fills your soul with power, raising your magic capacity. Yes! Now we're talking. So. To the next giant soul. wonder about those uh, those secrets. Do uh, you think we can get a notepad and write down what our, our squiddy friend says? I guess we could just look them up on Google. Yeah. So yeah we, can just, we can just take some notes. There's definitely going to be something to do with those things that I see all over the place. Here we are in the each side town of the Stranded Sailor, west of the door. Explore out this pier, this day thing. Alright, let's see. Just look at it up. Great. No more soup for us today, buddy. Let me, let me make sure I can actually find the. <laughs> so. Let's see, where's that head? This way to the mountaintops via Castle Lockstone. Interesting name. Castle Lockstone. There. I'll have to check it out. What's over here? Oh, more of these things. Onward to Castle Lockstone. Uh, I think we may Ooh. actually need to. Hello. Oh, it's the bard again. Well, hello there, fellow traveler. Go on, tell all. How's your adventure? Got any exciting tales I could knock out a song about? Reason being, I'm up in these here mountains seeking inspiration for my next masterpiece. I heard a monster lives up on the mountaintops. Can you believe it? A drunk fellow outside the stranded sailor says he lost his love to the beast. Fancy that. The way I see it, there's going to be one heck of an epic ballad waiting me up ahead. If only I could smash up these bastard rocks back the path. Well, you're in luck. For I can smash the rocks. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Happy dance. Look at that, mate. You smashed it. You're a legend. You might even be the inspiration for my next week, too. Yeah, if it's all the same to you, I might just tag along for your adventure. See you around. Sure. Toss a coin to your kitchen. <laughs> How much is this 
just just a ooh, just a thing I can whack. What's that big old statue is that the is that the king of, king of doors, the Lord of Doors? It might be. Ooh, a seat. Start by going left first. I found them. Excellent. hide things from me. Oh, nothing? Fantastic. Ah, the crystals grow back. Alright. It's um, this way. Okay. Oh. Perhaps not yet. Feels too quest continuing for my liking. What's up here? Oh, secrets! Across here and see what's up. Nothing much. Nothing really going on over here. Nope. Okay. <clears throat> well, onward. Is it starting to lightly snow? Mm -hmm. Oh, adorable. Onward into. This incredibly large fortress. Mm -hmm. Look at the size of the thing. It's Jeez. freaking tall. Okay. Castle Lockstone, the frozen fortress. Cool. That's how we unlock these gates. Shook, shook. Ooh. I have a feeling it's going to be a bit of a puzzle heavy. Yep. And we have a new door. Yes. Fantastic. Do we have zones? I don't think so. I think we're in around 400 mm. right now. Maybe this yep. Yeah, you need Correct. To for upgrades, right? At this point, yes. Yeah. And then a thousand. Mm -hmm. Seems like a lot. Well, yeah, but I mean, like the orbs you find around are like 100 each. And... Hello. Hey again, pal. I hope you don't mind me tagging along. Seems like we'll need to find a way through the old fortress if we want to get up on that mountain. Well, I say we, I mean you. I'll just hang around here and work on the lyrics for my next banging tune. Let me know if you find a way out. I'll do. Like is that? I'm gonna say I work on the lyrics for my next banger. Let me know if you find a way out. Yes, it is a great hat. That, that's yep. That's gonna be an elevator at some point, I swear. Yeah, probably. It's There's a couple of ways out of this place. So let's see. Start over here. So many places to go. So many places to go. Oh, oh, that's not cool. Okay.
definitely need some sort of power to get across to there. Okay, cool. Ooh, what's down here? Ah! Ah! Not great. <laughs> this is not going well. Freaking blazers? Yep. Oh, yeah, got it. I think that was pretty good. Yeah. To be honest. Oh boy. Oh, new enemies. low so often to actually play well. Uh, it's so cold. Oh. What? Oh, this is the start. Fantastic. Hop in there and get my health back. Fair enough. <clears throat> More loading screens. Mm -hmm. I think I have enough seats. Okay, so that was the left entrance. <laughs> He's sitting down with pieces of paper. <laughs> He's working on lyrics. He's got some else to say. Hunting souls for breakfast, lunch, and nope. <laughs> That's great. Yep. Alright, what's through here? Do you want some Definitely can't get to that key without some sort of no. ability. But we can climb this ladder. Here. This is to go. I know, right? Ooh, back. Here lies Lord Lockstone, the first load of doors to make a deal with death. Ooh. Ooh, their legacy is inestimable and their reign absolute. A cold ruler concerned with law and order, consolidated power, and go on to build the foundation of the Hall of Doors. Okay, interesting. Okay. Cool. That's a thing that happened. Oh, I definitely cannot proceed here. No. Okay. What? We go. Oh, well, hello. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, there was something. Excuse me. Hello. This is the resting place of we, the Lord of Doors. I am Lord Lockstone, for whom the script was named. We Lords of Doors were an anomaly, a mistake of the universe, some might say. But is that not an apt description of all life? A, mis a mistake of the universe, one which grows and thrives, existence born into consciousness. As to preserve that consciousness is the most important and noble goal.
sure, as long as you're not at the expense of others. Show all the dead crows around. Yeah, exactly. It seems to be a bit suspect. Oh, hello. That's right, I can hit some of these projectiles back at it. Alright. less of those enemies. Give me your shinies. Give them to me. Right. Let's attempt that again, shall we? We'll see. It's another pop board, so. Another pop through this fortress. Oh, I don't know. I thought it was one of the pedestals, so it might not be accessible. Uh, yeah. Some would call it an honor. I would call it a tragedy. <clears throat> Let's head 
down. Oh, there's a staircase. There's a staircase over there. Good. I wasn't sure. Alright. Uh, that looks like a laser. Do not like. Okay, good. That was easy enough. Yeah. Okay, so there's a little indicator of which tiles are the, uh. Oh, I can't roll through it. That's kind of blows. Go. Excellent. Got it. I was afraid I was gonna lose my health. <laughs> oh, there's a seed over there. Let's to the next row. Oh, more of this, huh? More of this. <laughs> the first successor of the lineage of lords. Their transition to power was smooth and their reign egalitarian. Remembering, f remembered for their fair nature and forcing better working conditions for the rebels. Okay. Cool. Yeah, that did not continue. Yeah. <clears throat> My life is ending, but this lord plans to live forever. It doesn't feel fair to me. Definitely isn't. Yeah. 
someone who also doesn't have these abilities. Posted in this fortress, I have learned a great deal about the old Lord of Doors. Still don't much care for them. Fair. Fair enough. Mincing is one of the many uh, trapped you all here. Yep. Alright. Let's go. Uh, aren't I always? <laughs> he says, sleeping head first into the door. Going back to Avarice, are you? Where am I now? Hello. Back into Avarice. Stretch. Um, um, um. I like that Baby Bird <clears throat> does a stretch. He, know, he knows. He knows happening. what's coming. <laughs> Some sort of fire wizard. Will not allow. Oh, 
hard to cough with you like this. Oh no. Oh no. I just immediately smashed. Oh, that's mean. Yes, give me the door. Gosh. I should fire at you. How would you like that? Huh? How did I miss? Give it another go. <laughs> yeah. I'm giving this great attack. Big green. A gift to a fellow crow to aid you in your quest. Yes. Bestow your gifts unto me, giant crow spirit. Hookshot spell acquired. Yeah. Yes. Now I wonder if you can use the street lamps on the little floating islands here. No. 
don't know. That one's too high, but it looks like it. Hey! That's pretty cool. Yeah. We're this appears to be a Reaper's abandoned logbook. The removal of the legacy doors has seriously impeded my investigation into the disappearance of the Reapers in the redacted region. This whole process of transferring to the new system has been a nightmare. I have found evidence that many workers were active in the region when the orders were given to cut them off. More worrying still is that the act of reaping mission in the area was also purged from the system. Somewhere out there is a soul that has not been reaped on time. It's a recipe for disaster, that's for sure. We all know what happens to souls if they remain alive past their death date. We do? What happens right now? Doesn't sound like it's good. Yeah. So this doesn't use any magic, which makes me happy. Alright. Alright. Oh, are we back at the bus stop? Yeah. And huh. now you can just check out all the things. Yeah. Seems like the photos is clicked. Still. I know, I agree. Well, <clears throat> that Vaga reckons that something big's gonna happen here soon. You know anything about that, buddy? Uh, maybe. Maybe so. Maybe I do, maybe I don't. <laughs> oh, we should go ask him what he thinks about me. Swarm. Maybe we're taking it now. I see. They're adorable. I don't know why anyone was complaining. These things are adorable. And they're like the same TV shows as me. <laughs> Tell me, have you ever seen a mountain? If you ever get a chance, try and explore. What a wonderful creation they are. Titans of nature. I am currently trying to get to a mountain to explore. Okay, where was I? So I don't know if that's look shotable. Oh, never mind. Okay. Where am I going? <laughs> Not sure. Uh -huh. Okay. Hi. <laughs> wow. Found a scale model of a Reaper door. It doesn't function, it was probably made to evaluate the designs for the modern doors that we use today. Oh, the other one was an ancient door. Yeah. It's a Reaper's abandoned long book. I'm done with this job. I found the notes from the investigator looking for the events around the disappearances of Reapers and the closures of all those active doors. This lord of doors doesn't give two shinings about it, any of us crows. What is it all for? Myself and a few of the other Reapers, I've convinced to join me, are heading into the Forbidden Region to see what we can find. I hope we can start a new life without the commission. A new challenge awaits us. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, that's where Reaper originates. Maybe. Alright, so. Okay. Got a shot on the way back again. Migraine. They're coming through the doors that you left open. Honestly, you're turning my office into a dimensional Swiss cheese. Second. Oh, there's a golf one. Oh my gosh. My little friend got into my ink supply. The poor dear. Although she doesn't seem to mind. Maybe she just loves the smell of ink as much as I do. <laughs> Welcome to the Soul Vault. Would you like to increase your combat abilities? Yes. This one here. 
is a thousand tokens. <clears throat> ah, achievement unlocked. Big spender. Which is 12 stamina. done and done. Go. This opens up so much. There's so many things, <laughs> so many places to go back to. Oh gosh, well, I mean, uh, you're gonna need to go back for like shrines and secrets. I know. So we know there's a key in here. Bird bones. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What's up here? Full the lava. Shook. Yes. Nice. Water. Perfect. Here lies Lord Deadbolt, <laughs> the fourth in the lineage of the Door Lords. Their rule was dark, but per produced efficiency among reapers. An overbearing ruler concerned with keeping order and funding research into other sustainable forms of life extension. Yeah, they all just want to live forever. The first two didn't seem to, but then... Yeah. We also haven't seen the third, either. Uh, um, Get to the other one? Yeah. Yeah. I'm sure we'll get past there again eventually. We have to say. My life was not easy. The balance of the universe was my duty. Mine alone. The Lord who created me had grand delusions about fate and purpose. But fate did not bind me to death's door. Duty did. No other could take on the task of controlling life and death, so I bore the burden. 
board for as long as I could, even extending my life beyond the bounds set by the pitiful anachronism that is death. When my time finally drew to a close, my successor paid no heed to my teachings. I fear their reign may have destroyed the balance I tried so hard to maintain. What a bitter disappointment they have been. Oof. Greatness is seldom free, Crow. True greatness may even cost you your soul. Okay. Wow. Uh, Lord of Doors. I think I know where this comes from. Yeah. And... Some spiders. Some kind of signed contract. How exciting! <laughs> Not sure what kind, but some kind. All the shinies. Very, very important shinies. The little ones. That's right. out of this room. Just gotta make sure. Not that I can see. Oh, the lever. Alright, there's oh. number three, it looks like. Yep. Here lies Lord Opengate, yeah. the third in the lineage of lords. Their rule was steady and without hindrance. A ruler skilled at delegation spent many of their years expanding their knowledge on traveling the vastness of space. Okay. Oof. Oh, and the bard has, like, six pages now. <laughs> <clears throat> Greetings, young reaper. Your presence here is quite a conundrum would indicate that the course of events which started with the formation of Death's Door has led the universe to the brink of great peril. However, it is also indicative of those actions correcting themselves. Life is merely the universe experiencing itself. And as the universe seeks balance in all things, we, as parts of it, are all acting to maintain that balance. So true to your path, young reaper, we can sense victory in your future. Oh, okay. That was kind of nice. Right. Who knew ten thousand things? All eyes and tentacles and something. Sometimes wings. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. That's into the 
this place basically. Yeah. Maybe it's a different direction from over here. Okay. That's not cool. Ha! Oh no! What has happened to your life at the hands of our chaos? I was never sold on the idea of preserving the course of life and death. Each lord creates the next in succession before their death and teaches them the lord's path. My creator, the lord before me, bound me to their system. All I could do was try and balance the world as fairly as I could. I tried my best to do right by the living, especially the crows, recruited into something that had, they had no business in. If opportunity presents itself, child, ending the cycle would be what is right for the universe. My lifetime was too short to come to that ultimate conclusion, but I remain hopeful that others will react in their own. Reach out to the 
reach it on their own. Okay, well, I guess that's what we're doing. Mm-hmm. Bringing in uh, just now, this hole. How thing. do we get to that one, uh, like, shiny? One of their helmets. I don't know. Ladders on the left side, is there anything? No, that's not the way. Right. Let me check. I'm pretty sure if that other thing is gonna be a fall down from somewhere else. This is just yeah. oh wait, there is something here. Yeah. Oh, we can get to that eventually anyway. Alright, let's go down and see what we can see. Yep. More of those little green things following me through, infesting, <laughs> infesting the wall of doors. Yep. Fantastic. Things are certainly starting to heat up. Where do we find ourselves now? This way to our camp. See you soon. Alright. But of course, I will always go the other way first. For I must know. Dare attack me. This is being nice. Through the first punch. stairs. Hello there. Or at least they're a terrible OSHA violation. <laughs> they're just camping up here. And I woke up. I'm just, I'm, I was just going to ignore them, but no, they had to attack me. This is a rickety ass branch. Look at this. Yep. Sheesh. Yep. Are those like crows? They look like they're crows. They are.
here. What? Go back. see that. <laughs> hey! Oh, welcome to the camp of the Free Crows, old friend. <clears throat> we knew you'd make it here eventually, even if you needed a bit of guidance along the way. <laughs> we are a group of free-thinking individuals who reject the ideas of the Lord of Doors. We do not want unnatural immortality. If it must come at the cost of our lives, what is the point of living forever if it is to be a slave? No, nope, we choose to live free and die free. So go, climb ever higher, defeat the beast at the top of the mountain, claim its soul. Oh, but make sure you're well prepared before you head onwards. Remember, you're welcome here at any time you like. Yeah. Or not. Make sure you're well prepared before you head onwards. Remember, you're welcome here any time you like. Okay. Oh. Foretold crow, it is an honor to meet you. Did you find any of our shrines on your journey? Raven. It seems there are still ten shrines you have yet to find. I am sure they will help you on your journey in the fight with the beast atop the mountain. Do I really have to go find ten that that many more shrines? Okay, jeez. So many. Greetings, foretold crow. This is the gate of knowledge. Its eyes are see all things, its heart knows all things, and its soul exists in all things, it whispers to us when we need guidance, and foretold your royal arrival and your destiny. That one's Corvus and the other one is Raven. Nice. Showing me anything. Okay, so now the real question is... Continue onward. I'm going to fight, try and find all those other shrines that I apparently missed. Jeez. I mean, there are some that you wouldn't even be able to see because you have the, uh. The yeah. Going spell. What it's actually called. <laughs> the grapple spell. Hookshot spell. spell. It's, uh, it's quite a steep climb getting up here. My pipes are still wheezing. You must be pleased this punch though, huh? I mean, a secret crow society up here on the mountains? Who knew? And they have so many great stories about their lives up here, especially about the beast atop the mountain. Yeah, I'm getting so much inspiration on our adventure. I think my next song might be the greatest I've ever written, and I've written more than five. <laughs> Yeah. They've been the ones putting the signs up everywhere. Mm hmm That's great. Which, in retrospect, makes a lot of sense. Yeah. This is way. Let's wait to the frozen canyon. Exercise caution. My little crow feet do not like this. They go slippy slide. You should try. What's on timer? Let's see. That's why you have a thing to be going through something. Alright, better I do that. Seems like the thing to do. Oh. Yes, 
wax and crystals. No, stop putting me back here. That's not cool. Rolling off, you silly crow. Why do I always roll off the stupid level? I swear. It's just that one area. Oh no! No, why? Shrine offers you a shard for vitality crystal. You now have three shards, one more raises your vitality. Okay. 
nine shrines left. Yep. Apparently. The question is, do I go back through the world and search for a bunch of shrines? Use my new powers to get around? Or do I go to the lair of the beast? secrets from me, will you? Found a shiny medallion! You're a real winner! Yeah! <laughs> yeah. I think it might be a good idea to have, like... Let's hunt down the mountain beast, I'll be right behind you. Well, at a safe distance. <laughs> The start. Yep. Leave us this one. Spirits. Yep. I love your little goth nature spirit <laughs> on, on the typist lady's desk. Yeah, it's pretty great. Signed soul location. That's right, this was where it was initially assigned. Is there anything here? Secrets here that I can do. Ooh, There's yeah. Is that one of the things I can hook on to? I think so. It is. Secrets. Already I found one. Feels good. But now we're talking. <laughs> Hello. You found a makeshift soul key. I wonder who made this. Okay. I guess it's just a shiny. It's not a useful object anyway. Yeah, it doesn't look like... Go back and get all these, find all these things, huh? Mm -hmm. Oh, I think I know where this is gonna lead. Hey! Hello! At least I'll have one more health. Yep. There's still eight more shrines, so you'll be able to get one more each. Lead a crystal fills your soul with vigor, granting more health. Do you remember where any of those secrets that the squid told us about were? Ah, uh, yes, the squid secrets. Squid. Yes, those secrets. Those squid secrets. You <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> so not get into that door. Not yet, at least. Okay, so... Uh, there is a hidden path next to an elevator in the center of the cemetery just after you cross the Great Bridge. We're in the cemetery. Mm -hmm. Forgotten where the Great Bridge is. Oh, we'll just have to wander around. Yep. Good This, this isn't the Great Bridge, is it? 
that is the, the same as the other tower, and you can't get into it. I know, right? I'm gonna be able to get into it some some way. But those things, like. Yep, there's still lots, lots to um, uncover, it seems. Here? Yeah, maybe so. Maybe, and we, we already found that one, I believe. And the other one are both uh, about the estate of the urn witch. Which or forest first? Probably where which is best. Probably so. Uh, on wood. I do. Let's see if there's anything back this way. Let's go. here again. There was like a seed or some souls back there at one point. Making sure there are no seeds here. Yep. But no, this is where we started. Yep. Cool. Go. Shrines. Another secret house, doppelganger house, if we can find it. Yeah. Uh, oh, 
USP has decided to do uh, Breath of the Wild on dog percent. I see. We find and pet all of the dogs. <laughs> Alright, so, the two secrets of the Unwitch. Uh, a secret lies submerged beneath the moat in the estate of the Urnwitch. Opening it will require bringing an open flame to the East Gardens, which you have the flame ability. Then, behind a powerful witch's house lies a secret, accessible from the west side. To find it, you must look for opening through the hedge. So we're not really at her estate as yet, I guess. Yeah. Is that a door that you can right open? Looks like it. It's all this, then. Aha! Yeah. Oh, these. Cool. damage over time. Yes. Nice. That's pretty great. Yeah. Animation. <laughs> Upgrade the fire ability. Cool. Nice. Oh. Um. <laughs> okay. That is all those things. This is the elevator. Outskirts around the mansion. Yeah. So there's one secret submerged in the moat, apparently. Um, okay. For and opening it requires you to have the flame spell, which you do now. Oh, cool. Here. Second, I thought there was, but. Right. Nope. To the earth, which is a state. I'm genuinely unsure how you're supposed to. Do it. I guess we'll figure it out eventually. Right. Did, I, did I find this last time? Yes. Yes. Wait, hold on. Here we go. You busted in that yet? Hey! Definitely new stuff over here. Oh, here we go. That yep. there there, probably. Seems likely. Find a seed in a box. Right. Okay. 
Speaking of. Some souls. Nice. Okay. Secrets. That's right, there were all these things the last time we could use. Yeah. Very sneaky. Let's go this way and see what we can find. Oh, nothing. Wonderful. How'd you get around there? That's yeah. the gap in the hedge, isn't it? Looks like. Let's go. Still don't know how those work. Ah, uh, cats. They do whatever they want. Those, uh, those things. I'll know what they do one day, I'm sure. Oh, ooh, I found a gap. Gaps in the <laughs> you are. There's a gate that was in the wall there. Oh. How to get. Oh, oh, I saw something. Let's 
see there's like a those are stairs. That's coming from below. How do I even get there? It's in fact a mystery. Places to go. So many places to go. And like also how to get up there because I believe there's something up there. No. Never mind. Okay. Or that might be the way down, so I have to go in this side somewhere. This. I like it. Gotta use those things again, huh? They will figure out how to use those. Be a happy day. You're a lot more foresty. Yeah. This is the moat. Yeah, I see that. Corner and oh, we did this one already. Right Pulled some sort of lever. Just look at these gaps over there, but I can't. This little tiny wall. <laughs> oh wait, that's that's the way in. Yeah. Of course it is. Haha, <laughs> this is the way around the back of my house. Yes. yes. Now 
Let's go figure out how to drain this. Also. Ooh, a shiny. Get over there. Get over there. Secrets. Shiny. Face. Daggers. You found some rogue daggers. These blades can speedily affect damage to an opponent. Death by a thousand cuts. Oh, you got a new weapon. They're, they're shaped like little, uh, little beaks. Yeah. Cool. That's pretty cool. And a lever. Six swings. Oh, so we can dash it. Oh, I like that a lot. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, it's yeah, sweet. It's the stone. Right. Shortcut. up in that other pathway. Mm. Oh, yeah. never mind. Just straight to a shrine, huh? Heck yeah. Okay. Fantastic. Okay. Cool. I don't know about draining the boat, though. <laughs> right? Ooh. Me too. Maybe I just assumed because it said submerged. Maybe. Yeah. It just 
said opening it will require bringing an open flame to the East Garden, so yeah, got it. Cool. I think there might, I don't know if there are a couple of more links around, but... I haven't s oh wait, I think I did see some actually. Right? Oh, they're running through the leaves, they look so cute. So, do you think there's anything else to discover in her? Maybe there is stuff in her house, I don't know. Right in her house? She didn't have the bomb spell when you went to sure. her house initially, so... I can do a knows. quick, can do a quick run through her house. Your daggers. Yes. It's so cute. So that other weapon we need to find in the um, the one that's like behind the spirit door, the ancient door in the Lord of Time, Lord of Doors Castle. Mm. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. The, the helmet. Or, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. Like That I recall. next. Coffins, bunch of spider eggs. Get in there because you didn't have the 
initially because you didn't have the bomb spell or the grappling. I forget where that is. Yeah, <laughs> friend too. <laughs> They've spread to the other desks. Yep. Where are we going again? The forest. Unless there's anything in her laboratory or place or anything. Question. Right. Furnace might have might have had some things. Just gonna look around quick. Please have it so vibe. Yeah, it didn't really have any of the sure enough there's some in the forest. Oh yeah. that we know about who we just don't know how to get to. We worked through all of our cephalopod friends' uh, lovely hints. We got them all? Yep. Cool. Although, wait, now he's a... I don't think it's, it's a smooth as that. Unsure. The squids. I don't know. The thing that interests me here is that I need right. to know. I need to know how to get to that chest. Right. I am frustrated that I can't get to that chest right now. No. Oh, oh, wait, there's something. There's something. Jeez. Why always would I have... This almost definitely leads up to that next shrine. Mm -hmm. I, can, I can feel it in my it's, bones. It's gotta. Okay. 
Okay, yes. The squid is in fact a cephalopod. So. Great. Like I thought that was correct, but I doubted myself. I would have thought this would have stayed unlocked. Magic crystal. Two more to increase magic capacity. What are we down to? Five more shrines now? Five more shrines. Nice. Very nice. A ladder here though. This place has gotta like drain it some, right? Right, and I'm just not entirely sure how. Yeah, I understand.
did it with all of you. <laughs> yep. Objects obtained. We found Malform seed. It doesn't look like a normal seed. It feels quite rough. Huh. Okay. Okay. Question. A number. A number of them. I think we might have just about everything. I don't know that there's much more of access to it at all.
something that I can't use. Exclusive thing from the front camp. Mm -hmm. Never seen it as a lot. Looks. Uh, I think we went and I think in the dungeon, I think we went and followed the right? Yeah, I didn't see any of the hook things over there, so. There aren't any in his actual palace. Yeah, I don't think so either. Yeah, but I'm thinking I might just go and see what the beast's all about. <laughs> With one extra health and one extra power, I'm already feeling pretty pretty pumped up compared to how I've been playing most of the game. So Yeah. Anyway, that is a good place to stop. Thank you once again for watching and joining us on this journey through uh, the doors of death. <laughs> and uh have a good day. Bye. Farewell.